Hello everybody, welcome back to Slide Rancher, this is going to be episode 2. I have just finished episode 1, and it will be uploaded soon. These guys are hungry again. I better go sell these plops. And now I can make my farm. Which I'm going to make up here. So I'd like to go with carrots. I'd also like to figure out what the hell a new bucket ornament is. Let's go into my slimepedia. Doesn't say it, my slimepedia. Can I sell it? I cannot sell it. Here's where I can get the water tank upgrade. They seem to be hungry again, which is a little annoying. I should build another silo soon. Yes, okay, that means. If possible, please acquire the following for a future study. My thanks. I can acquire basically all of those things. Yes, I can. Okay, so, uh. I'll go grab the, uh, pink and the blue slimes. <coughs> <coughs> How many of each do you want? Five blue and six pink. I'm going to deposit these pink slimes and sell these pink plops just to free up space. I need three of the night slimes. Five of these guys, okay. 
This shouldn't be too hard. So just gonna get all the food off so that these guys can produce more food if they have more plops. to go get my where did that appear? I need to go get five of the rock slimes. One two I'm gonna throw you so I can absorb these blue plops. Cause they sell for more than the pink ones do. I'm ready to see some Lago. I did not like that. Where are some more blue ones? Still need two more blue ones. Or walk slimes if you want to use their correct name. One, okay. I better quickly fucking grab all these pink plops before I have to deal with a logo. Shit is going down, and I just like it a lot. I just like it with all of my being. You know what I can do? I'm pretty sure. Oh, what? I can't have two of the same pulps. Okay, that's a bit. That was a, uh, all, that was a tar slime. And let me just say, they are little shits. What do you want? You just want a bunch of chickens, don't you? Yeah. Treasure pot is locked. Sure, I've got enough. No, I just need to get on back. <laughs> Suck up any pink, or any um, blue or black orbs I see. But I forget which one is worth more. It's getting night time, so... <laughs> oh, 
close to being able to get the uh, nighttime slime, which flies around, which is why they're, and die in sunlight, which is why they're so hard to actually launch, because you have to get the uh, high roof update, you have to get the net, you have to get the net upgrade, so they don't fly over the top, then you have to get the sunproof walls, the net can also break if they ram into it too much. Food. I'll grab you two stony hens. I'll also grab you two regular hens. So now what was I making next? Well, I do have my farm here. Is this done? Yes, it is. Let's go put these carrots away. Sell my pops. Check how much time I have left to go on this. Okay, so got a little bit of time. Now we just come out here. We have all the pink plops we see. Here they go. They're called phosphor slimes. And they can fly. <laughs> Which is why I'm not going to be ranching them until a much later date. So I have three, we get six just in case. Now, I could be on my way. Look at that moon. in a minute. How many do you want? He only wanted three. That means I'm just gonna throw the other three out there. I'm gonna suck up the rest of you and quickly one over. Suck up you. And grab these guys back. Oh shit, I have a, a lot of money. Well, I could probably upgrade you. Additional storage. If 
first I'll buy the water thing, so now I can suck up water. And then I'll buy additional storage. Oh, also, I can upgrade this. So we have those clops. Start a heartbeat farm, and then right here is where I'm going to make a, another corral. Now let's check up on my slimepedia. So we have the rock slimes. These slimes are totally metal, or totally metal. <coughs> Diet veggies favorite. Heartbeat. Slimeology. Rock slimes earn their names from the rocky crown of their spike of their sharp spikes of top atop their head. Their slimy bodies, god damn it. But their affection for minerals doesn't end with their appearance. Rock slimes are strict vegetarians, favouring the satisfying clunch of heartbeat, most of all. Or <laughs> ancho whisks. Give me a minute, I'm just gonna blow my nose. Okay, I have returned from blowing my nose. Okay, to the dangers of a rock slime should be fairly obvious. The rocky crown is sharp enough to pierce straight through a rancher's boots, but it's not all about watching where you're stepping, as these rocks are always rolling. When you see a rock slime rolling up for a tumble, it's best to get out of the way. Plotonomics. Rock plots are prized for being a key component in the production of blue metal, an amazing alloy that's stronger than titanium and lighter than plastic. Because of its ama amazing strength, blue metal is often a key component in the holes of light speed, capable starships, synthetic appendages, and protective hollow phone cases. Okay, now let's look at the tabby slime. Those stripes, that tail, that wiggle, 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 diet meat. Favorite, stony hen. Slimology. Tabby slimes share many curious similarities to domestic house cats of Earth. With their perky cat ears, striped backs, and swaying tails, you'd almost mistake them for a true feline, if they weren't made entirely of gooey slime, of course. <coughs> a tabby slime... Ranger whisks. A tabby slime generally doesn't mean any harm to a rancher, but like their spiritual earth cat cousins, often causes a great deal of chaos anyway. Tabby slimes love to steal things they don't eat, like fruits and veggies, resulting in lots of unintended Largo transformations on the range. Plotonomics. Tabby plots are a key ingredient in a variety of performance-enhancing products that grant the consumer a surge of the tabby slime's signature energy and exuberance, and while athletes the, wo the world over take them to gain an edge, prolonged use often results in uncontrollable butt wiggles, other, and other, another l less desirable signature of the tabby slime. Phosphor slime. The softly glowing holes of starlight. Diet fruit. Favourite? Q-berry. Psymology. Phosphor slimes come out at night, flying above about the moonlit range upon their translucent wings. Phosphor slimes have a luminescent slime core that pulses with a soft glow, making them easy to spot. For this reason, ranchers, ranchers sometimes call them, refer to them as low stars. Rancher whisks. Phosphor slimes have special needs compared to your typical slime. Phosphor slime. And its plorts will qu quickly vanish if exposed to sunlight, meaning the rancher could quickly lose an entire coal worth of rancher slimes if they're not careful. Ranchers must either vac them up, before daybreak, or keep phosphor slimes in a place that is perpetually dark, like a cave. Plotonomics, the luminescent compound found within phosphor plots, phosph phosphor plots can produce light for over 100 years, making an incredible eco-friendly form of illumination on Earth. Cities across the globe are slowly switching over to phosphor lights, saving trillions of gigawatts of energy daily. Plus, if you have this stuff in the hair, it glows and looks really cool. Hell yeah. Let's have Largo slimes. T the tar. Those awful ravenous rainbows. Slimes. Diet slimes. Favorite ranches. Slimology. The tar are formed when two Largo eats a plot unlike the one it's pr it produces. 
A terrible transformation occurs that turns the slime into a sludge field. Into a sludge field with swirling prismatic array of colours and relentless appetite. The tar seek only to consume and replicate. The only way to stop a tar outside of incinerating it or throwing it into, sli into the slime sea is with fresh water. Run, spla run splash will stop a tar from spawning new tar, and repeated splashes will, de will destroy it entirely. Alternatively, many, many ranchers will recommend running away with their arms waving and screaming. Rancher risks. The, the ra rancher risks. The tar is the single biggest threat to ranchers. The tar will seek out slimes to consume and replicate themselves, but will also devour chickens, rock crops in their proximity, and even devour ranchers. Remember, ranching largos may be highly profitable. But one stray plot, you could wind up devastating with a devastating tar outbreak. Plotonomics. The tar produce no plots, only more tar, and then more tar still. More tar. Uh, we'll check out the resources at some point. <laughs> but for now, have a heartbeat. Have a heartbeat. See? They produce two plots. If they like what they're eating. Chuck you in here. Hi. I see you. In fact, I'll probably just grab you guys and... And save you for later, I guess. It seems like you cannot store slimes. Well, back out you go. I'm gonna sell my rock plots. See, they give me much more money. Cowards. Oh, let's see what's on with the star mail. Uh, Victor Humphreys and Casey. Let's sleep until morning. Return to the ranch. Nothing going on there. Hey, wait a minute. Alright, what do rock slimes eat? Veggies, yeah. Ow. How could you do this to me, man? Might have to look up what the hell I do with that relic thing.
just go store, store these heartbeats. Pops. Well, we have to create some sort of slime, you know, in plot storage at some point. It seems like something that I'll need to do. I'll have to end the recording in a second. That's going to be episode two. Okay. Oh, is this giving me a... Is this giving me upgrades? Is that what it's giving me? It seems like it. Got you, man. I'm saving you. I wanna let you die, man. Hmm. Sorry about this man. I mean technically I'm saving me. He doesn't have to like, or he doesn't have to live with me, because I'm a terrible person. And now he also doesn't have to wait inside my thing until I can build my habitat, which is probably going to take forever. Stop rolling at me, please. That man just got eaten. Ow.
Okay. Oh, hey, look, a cubeberry tree. Oh, yeah, you're on with some stone hands. There's not really much going on over here. <laughs> Always usually. things that I need to open this gate. So I need a slime key, which sadly is something that I do not have. You get them from the Gordo slimes when you feed those guys like a whole bunch of food. the thing to unlock this yet. Forget how you unlock this. Because I'm a dumb. I'm big dumb, not smart. This one is also locked. You guys are the ones that liked the Q-Bellies, right? Yeah. I have no idea what I am or how to get back up. Ah, okay. Those guys are poo-poo heads. Ow. Okay, there was way too many of those assholes. Treasure pod is locked, of course. So yeah, I have no idea why. Okay. I see. Yeah, that's where that leads. It's good to know. So yeah, there's probably another thing that I have to do back. Yeah. Hopefully it'll give me better stuff. Good job there, because I missed that guy there. But I'm not gonna yet. So yeah, I can go through there once I get the jetpack upgrade. Which I'll probably get next. Now we gotta sell out plops. Grab a whole 
bunch of those. And a whole bunch of those. Or Ogden Ortiz. I'm working on a new recipe. Help me out. I mean, yeah, I can do it. And how much does he need? It's five kilos and sixteen carrots. Check my Q berries. Go five to this guy. this thing storage again. So now all meat food items can go in here. the jetpack. Heck yeah. Now let's go to sleep. Anyway, that's why I'm probably going to end this. So still no outro, but Thanks, bye.